What to do if your mother is a narcissist? How to limit her toxic influence? Hi everyone. We can't deny that some kids may have to grow up with a narcissistic mother. Well, you might be one of them even. It means that they might not get their parents' full attention and care as other children do. Worse, they might even become objects for their parents' skulls. This condition could affect children's beliefs, behavior when they grow up, and self-esteem. If you have grown enough and now you know that you have a narcissistic mother, how can you deal with the situation? How to deal with your mother? Well, in this video, we're going to give a little insight into this. Before moving further, I hope you can help this channel grow by liking and sharing this video with your friends and relatives. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you're new here. Let's get to the main thing. 1. Set a clear boundary. Narcissistic mothers often want to control their kids in anything. She even tries to take her anger out to you if she doesn't get her way. That's why you have to set a clear boundary. Let your mother know things she allows and not allows to do to you. Help her to deal with her anger so it doesn't lead to something destructive. Asking for help from an expert is a good solution because it will be difficult to fight against your mother. Indeed, setting clear boundaries is a healthy solution instead of letting her doing anything to you. 2. Control your emotion Sometimes a narcissist insults you to trigger your reaction. Your mother knows that she can control and shift your mood as they please when you react emotionally. Stay calm and control your emotions no matter what she does to you. Make a clear action, such as leaving the conversation until your anger slows down. Fighting your mother back without any preparation will worsen the condition. Remember, your calm is a powerful alarm to fight against a narcissistic mother. Take a deep breath, accept that your mother has a narcissistic personality disorder, and leave the conversation. 3. Leave the house Make an extreme action, such as leaving the house if the situation is out of control. Then find information about reputable therapists or experts that can help to deal with psychological issues, including narcissism. Leaving the house is an effective way to avoid conflict with your mother. At least you can think clearly about the solution to cope with the situation. Go home only with a therapist or the one who can explain to your mother to keep you and her comfortable during the confrontation. 4. Get help You can't fix a problem only by leaving the conversation or the house, but you also need to get help. Try to browse reputable therapists or experts who deal with psychological issues. Talk to a counsellor so you can understand the actual condition of your mother. It also helps to know how the condition affects you if you let it without any solution. Indeed, this action helps to find the best and effective solution to cope with a narcissistic mother. As a result, the condition is under control and you can get your comfortable and safe life back. 5. Plan your response Your narcissistic mother wants you to react to her actions. Instead of giving an emotional statement, you can control the situation. That's why creating a plan to respond to your narcissistic mother is crucial. For example, you can say that you have to go right away if the conversation is deteriorating. The idea is how to cut the conversation or debate before your mother insults you. Good preparation will make you a bit calm while facing your mother. Indeed, back to the most vigorous defense to fight against narcissists, calmness. Well, what do you think of this video? Let us know your thoughts and experiences in the comment section below. Subscribe to this channel and click the bell icon to receive notifications of our subsequent video updates. Thanks for watching.